and welcome back to us on a mangy horse not doing very good not looking the best not looking the most professional but we're back on gold rush 2.0 uh hopefully today we're gonna be getting our gypsy cob if you guys watched the last video unfortunately the horse trainer who i believe had our gypsy cob was sick so hopefully we can get some better luck today we also grabbed a bunch of the shell casings and gunpowder from harry that we purchased in the last episode i ended up buying us a mangy for like 120 bucks saddles were like 20 dollars it's whatever it is but we were able to transport a little bit more over i ended up turning a bunch of it into of course the ammo uh most of the ammo is over in black water because we want to be a little a little careful of course going across the border with it we want to make sure no guards see it and get suspicious of us so we're trying not to leave any of that ammo in mexico but today we're hopefully going to be heading over to cougar ranch starting off getting ourselves our new horse again hoping so it should be there it's been a while and we've already paid for everything so really hoping it's there uh hoping we can finally get it actually tack it out not be riding on a freaking mangy looking like we just freaking got off the boat it's our first day in town hopefully not anymore so uh, after that i believe we also have a little meeting with harry we got to give him his payment from the ammo that we weren't able to make previously uh talk to him a little bit and i believe we're going to finalize the prices for the high velocity ammo as well as the shotgun slugs as well hopefully start selling that uh we're going to have i think a talk with either tommy or some of the other groups today i want to talk to the misfits as well i believe as well as the hateful since uh, we had children that a while ago try and figure something out with the ammo and uh yeah we got a lot to do today a lot to do um first of all again we're probably going to head over to cougar ranch get ourselves our new horse after that have a little talk with harry and then after that hopefully have a talk with tommy or one of the other groups around that i've been looking to talk to and get into the sales of uh, the ammo so without further ado i'm gonna go get take care of a couple things and i will hopefully meet you guys when we're over at cougar ranch over at cougar ranch oh hey this is not looking good this is not looking good Oh, wait, 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 are there people over there? What is that over there? Those turkeys? Wave at them. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you. What's up? Oh, sorry to disturb. Are you caught up on a chance? Uh, no, but you might want <sighs> to speak to him right there. Okay. He's the, uh, is owner. that Gordon? That's Albert. Okay, okay. All right. Sorry. Thank you very much. Oh, don't leave, please. Don't leave. I was just looking at him. I got distracted by whatever our horse got scared by, and he's gone. I looked away for two seconds. Where the heck did he go? I already. Uh, typical Zavia luck. The man just disappears the second we need him. Wait, is that him over there? Or is that a local? I think it's a local. I already Mr. Elbart. You ran by. All right. Well, uh, this sucks, but I think Saint Denis is the move, and then after Saint Denis, we'll come back here and hopefully get some better luck. I don't know. She's told me to talk to this Elbert fellow, but he seems to have disappeared. So yeah, I guess we're riding on our mangy all the way over to Saint Denis. Let's head over there. Oh boy. I I'm over here on a mangy today. What? Where's your, I think you're getting uh, your gypsy last night. Right, right, that's what I thought. I'm gonna go, I checked there earlier. There, there wasn't the person I need to talk to around. So I'm gonna go, after this meeting, I'm gonna head all the way back over there. And hopefully they're there. Cause I paid for the damn horse and it's been about four or five days since it was trained. Dang. It's been a little rough. Oh, hey, at least they didn't hike over here like you did yesterday. <laughs> yes, exactly, exactly. <laughs> oh. oh, thank you so much, by the way. I appreciate it. Been a little busy today trying to get everything uh, done in time. There you go. Thank you. Of course, yeah, right. don't, Thank you. Uh, don't don't worry about you know the Evans. You know, it's, oh, it's yeah. all right. I, I wasn't really expecting you to be able to just bust it out because I, I kind of sent it short notice. Um. Yeah. So after we have a talk uh, if you're gonna be around for a little bit uh, i'm gonna head over to solomon town and hopefully grab some uh, iron from there and then i should be able to make it up for you if you're gonna be around worst case i can deliver to tomorrow or whatever you want yeah uh well yeah nav here is gonna be the one buying it now yeah. you, you gonna be around yeah. i'll be around yeah absolutely I will okay be. okay oh where will you be around you think 
Uh, I'll probably be, I'll probably stay around here at St. Denis. Okay, okay, okay. It might be a little bit, but I should be back here at some point. Okay, perfect, yeah. I'll, I'll probably be here for the night, so. Okay, I'll be okay. here for quite a while. Oh, uh, could I grab your telegram just worst case oh, if I'm not yeah. going to be able to make a day on tonight or yeah, something like that? I can absolutely give that to you. Okay, are you ready? Let me oh, know. Yes, I'm ready. All right, well, let's start off the top, Harry. First of all, sorry about the delay for this stuff, but here you go. No, it's all right. There's that one. There's that one. That one. That one. And that should be all. Perfect. And uh, how, how are we looking on materials? Like, um... uh, pretty good, to be honest. Um, that did take up a decent amount of them, but I still do have quite a bit of slugs left over. I think I still have some shells here. Uh, at the moment, it seems I'm pretty good on the gunpowder. Um, okay. But once I grab the shells from here, I should actually have a decent amount to sell. And that brings me to my next point. Uh, I've got some prizes together. I just wanted to get your idea on them. Sure. All right, just give me one second. All right, so starting off um, for the pistol, uh, it was going to be $80. What do you think about that? Sounds about right. All right, so uh, rifle would be 90. Repeater, yeah. 95. Revolver, 100. And then slugs, 110. The only reason the, the revolver is a little more expensive, it takes quite a couple extra resources to be able to get. No. Oh. That makes sense too. Well, I can only my big thought too about that is uh, a navy with one of those. Oh yeah, so yes. Right. Um Oh well, yeah, like a similar to the the pistol and the rifle. Um like I believe they take around the same amount of stuff to make, but uh, obviously the rifle is going to be a lot more sought after, so I figured a 10 dollar upcharge on that was a uh, fire. Oh, yeah, absolutely. yeah. That, 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 that was that, my that thought too with that sucker. Like I'm just picturing a bolt your um I forget the rifle that's the top with it. You know what I mean? Spring the exotic rifle. Spring <laughs> Oh, that thing would be crazy. I mean, the Springfield's already super powerful. With, with the having also drowns, it's going to be unstoppable. And again, uh, as I start dealing with these and start selling them, uh, then we can probably work on the prices from there. Um, looking at this, I don't know how. We'll see how it goes, but it might be too cheap. But we'll have to see. Well, yeah, just be like it's a, uh, it's an introduction offer. You know? Oh, exactly, you exactly. Know? Like when, when when I was starting up the the coffee store, when we were doing wholesale to saloons, the the first batch of goods we we gave them at a pretty steep discount just to kind of test the waters and make sure it's actually a product that they like and they enjoy, you know. Okay, yeah, I'll inform them. It's just a, a trial price, I would say, is what I'm gonna tell you. Yeah. And then yeah. Uh, depending on what happens next, uh, we'll go from there. Perfect. Uh, so I dug into those rumors about the explosive ammo um talked to some people yesterday and today <laughs> you're not you, you're not gonna believe this they so yeah but they, they might have Mexico. velocity well no they were looking for you okay they were like they were like yeah we went down to mexico we talked to the gunsmith to see if he had explosive rounds so i was like do you, well, I've had do you... i was like okay uh <laughs> do you know who the gunsmith is and they were like nope I was like, all right. <laughs> Man, I've had multiple people come to me asking for it. It's, it's just the same shit. No, no, uh, no one actually have an evidence of it yet. I'm guessing. No, yeah. the, the few people we've heard about it, I have gone to them and I said, if you actually find someone that can sell it, come to me. I will buy some because I want to see it in hand. I'll I spend like five hundred dollars or a grand just for one box, just to yeah. see that it's a real thing. You that's know what, what I mean? I, that's what I said. I said even if, because she was like, she was like, you know, it's like they were saying a hundred a shot. I said I don't care if it's a hundred a shot. I said. To, to actually have one in hand i want to be able to see it that it's real versus all the hearsay just mm -hmm. so that she, they were like okay well if we hear and i was like okay well you know but again we'll, we'll actually see if it was just hearsay or not or if it's a confusion with the high velocity i think that's it um that's my only idea at least uh just because i I get around the county quite a bit. There's yeah. no way I haven't ran into one person that's seen it. Um, I've had so many people mention it with not one ever seen it. Well, and the thing is, is at this point, if somebody has made it, I can't imagine that nobody would Has be heard it or it. seen it. it or right, like, exactly. at least, if someone's making it, I can't imagine they wouldn't be like, look what I've made. You, right, know, you gotta show that off to someone, right? Hey. To somebody. Yeah, or we'd hear about it being used. Mm -hmm. you know? Oh hell yeah! There, the, there's no the way. The second someone would... gets like a uh, their wagon shop on explosive round, the whole county's gonna hear about it. Everyone's yep. gonna be talking about it. Yep. So yeah. So I just I just doubt it's ever ever anyone's ever made any or seen any. Yeah. Uh, I have a few other leads that I'm following up on, but I haven't seen them yet. The, okay. 
to people so I'll, just, uh, I'll keep you posted on again that. please don't waste your time with this uh, too much yeah. it's just I, I think it's i think it's just not not not, not worth following or spending too much energy on oh no, it's, it's 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 fine i like <laughs> it's persistent fun. man harry persistent man. <laughs> yeah i'm determined i still think it's bullshit but but we'll see we'll see Plus, I'll, uh, I'll honestly use any excuse to get out of the store. <laughs> <Fair enough. laughs> All right. Well, uh, anything else you want to talk about? Hey, or if not, uh, I think I'm going to hopefully try and meet with some groups, try and get some orders together, and then uh, we'll see how business is going. All right. Yeah. Just keep me posted on materials. Of um, course. The, you know, and if, it's, if you ever need something run to you versus coming to Saint Denis, we could do that too. I mean, we've got horses and boats. It's, it'd be easy to get us. You know what I'm saying? If it's oh, yeah, yeah, but it was, Bros is a freaking pain in the ass. That's away. the that's the that's my thing. I, you know I'm, I'm used to it. I'm used to traveling from here to Chupros, to back to here to Limpany to Chupros to the Armadillo. I can imagine a lot of people are like, you come to us, and it's like, okay, I'm oh, walking, yeah. I guess. <laughs> Uh, since uh, since I'm so far away, I try to at least offer delivery. It, it, you know, it's the one thing I can offer. That's that's actually really true. That's true. You, the minute we were doing that in the beginning too, you offer delivery. People go, mm, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, people are real lazy. So anything that keeps the laziness <laughs> yeah, away, they lack. You, you are not wrong with that. <laughs> oh yeah, uh, you, you're um, you know, you're you're always welcome here in the in the coffee store if if things ever get weird out there in the county you know it's, it's, it's a safe appreciate. place it's a safe place for you i appreciate that harry all right all right well uh, i'm probably gonna be getting on my way then if y'all are on okay. saying no I think yeah that was it. I hopefully think that was it well you know send some good wishes and i'm gonna get my gypsy cop today please i, I need yep. all the ones i can get all the good wishes are yours <laughs> thank good you, wishes thank being you. sent <laughs> uh, all right well i'm gonna go see if that gypsy cop's ready hopefully it is all fingers right. Crossed, fingers crossed and good luck. All right. Y'all take care. You too. You too. Uh, I'm going to hopefully talk to some groups soon, Harry. So I'll let you know how that goes as well. I'll send you uh, a telegram. I'm not going to say any specifics in it, but obviously we can figure out the specifics in person. Trying to keep this stuff away from the telegram as much as I can. Yeah. Yeah. 100%. All right. Well, either way, I'll see y'all in a little bit. All right. Absolutely. Take care. Pleasure as always. All right. There we go. Nice little meeting with Harry. Getting him his ammo. Let's, uh, oh, Lee. That's, that's yeah. a lot of people. I think what we're going to do is head over to Limpany first. <laughs> See maybe if we can grab some iron because we do need to grab some iron for the shop. We will also then hopefully head over to the you stables know, after that. And our gypsy cob better be there at this point. It's been so long. I just want my freaking gypsy cob. Either way, though, let's uh, let's go over to Limpany first and then probably to hopefully get our gypsy cob. We are back at Cougar Ranch. And it's already not looking great. Uh, please, please, man. I just want my gypsy gob. I just want my. Ooh, 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 ooh. Please, please. Please, please. Oh, did any of y'all work here? Yeah, all three of us. Oh, that's perfect. Did any of y'all know a Kayla, I believe? Taylor? Kayla? Kayla? Kala? Kala, Kala. Sorry, sorry. Oh, yeah. I don't know if she's, she's awake. A, is she? But she's yeah, she's, she's oh, awake, me. but she's uh, training another horse at that client's horse at the moment, so I don't know where she is. Oh, okay. you wouldn't know uh, where she might be around? I'm, I've just been trying to grab my, my gypsy cob for about two or three days now. Try, uh, try Blackwater. Okay, okay, perfect. She's always there, isn't she? Yeah, Blackwater's usually your spot. Uh, do you know how she dresses or uh, her hair or anything like that, just so I can identify her? She wears like a she wears a white hat. With, white like, hat matches on the a side. A big white hat, poncho. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, yeah, lots like of a... gray and neutral colors. Just well, look for a girl with a uh, eye patch. Eye patch. What? 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 Scars, uh, what hat? A scar got on got her it. face. Perfect. Very tall. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank y'all very much. Uh, wish me best of luck. I've been trying to get this gypsy cob for a little bit now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Take care. Thank you. Over the black water we go. Over the black water we go. Finally, back over in black water. We're going to see if we can find Kala. Hopefully we can, because this has been a little bit of a pain trying to get our gypsy cob. Please, please, please be here. She wears, we were told, a white hat. Tall, white hat, tall, and eye patch. This should be pretty recognizable. Let's just do like a surveillance throughout the whole place. Hopefully, we can find her. 
Yeah, there doesn't seem to be many people around today. It seems like a pretty slow day. So you got the sheriff's now. They usually walk around town and such. Hi, Odie. Don't oh. worry. Uh, sorry to bother, Bonner. but uh, any of y'all know of a uh, Kayla around? I believe she's a horse trainer. Uh, Kayla, I think she's at, Kayla? um... Yeah, she's at oh. a cougar, right? That's where I just came from. Uh, she's not around mm. this time. The... Okay, okay. Thank y'all very much. Yeah, just keep looking at cougar. I forgot um, to get rid of this damn mangy. It's been rough. God damn, yeah. you got saddlebags and a mangy? This, listen, it's been a rough morning, okay? It's been a rough morning. I mean, that's that. I guess that's what our right time looks like. Don't look at me right now. Just don't look at me, please. I'm gonna go um, look for her. Saddlebags Thank and a mangy. That is rough. We have to long Monday. Don't let the boat hit you on the way out, oh, mate. Listen, it's been rough. <laughs> damn, we're getting made fun of, dude. We're getting made fun of. We'll have one last look for Blackwater, but I don't think she's here. Ah, uh, man, I just want my gypsy cob. I just want my gypsy cob. We'll do one more round around here, around the horse stable. Literally everyone making fun of us, all the shares making fun of our freaking mangy horse. Uh, yeah, we'll check the stable, but I think we ran out of luck. Yeah, no. Rip, rip, rip. Um, <laughs> I guess back to Cougar Ranch. I'm gonna keep looking for her, and I guess we'll see when we find her. Hopefully, this is not not been the best of luck so far. Alrighty, so it is now the next day. As you can see, we're still on the mangy. Uh, so yesterday. Let's just say we spent quite a couple hours. Uh, after that, I believe we ended up going back to Cougar Ranch. After that, I believe we then went to Armadillo. After that, I think we believe we went to Strawberry. Then I think we went back to Blackwater. We went back to Cougar Ranch. Then I think we ended up just finally coming back to Mexico. It was, uh, yeah, quite the unsuccessful endeavor. And if we go and check, I actually do have a telegram from Kala. We did end up sending her one uh, over in Strawberry. Thankfully, a fellow named Pez, one of the sheriffs up there, was able to help us out as well. But if we head over to the telegram station, we can check that we do have one for her. And I honestly don't think it's the best news. Let's go have a look. So if we have a little bit of a check, we can see we have one from Kala. And it says, your horse, dear Seville, your horse has completed his training and is ready to come home. I thought the training was going to be done a while ago, but I think I might have messed up the times or something. I'll be signing him over to someone who will hopefully pass him on to Gordon. So I will not be in town. I hope he reaches you quickly. Have a wonderful day. This is a little bit rough um, because she says she's signing it to someone. She didn't say who the person was, which makes it a little hard for us. Because if we don't know who the someone is, then I don't know who to get our horse from. We'll hopefully pass him on to Gordon. Uh, Gordon we know, but I'm not sure if we're going to get in contact with him. Hopefully he'll get in contact to fuss so i will not be in town uh yes so i don't know how long it's actually going to be until we get our gypsy cob it seems like the good old zavio luck is you know just doing his task as usual uh i do think we're possibly going to uh, hopefully get it in the next episode you know what? actually let's commit we are going to get our horse in the next episode by the next one no matter what i'm going to make sure that happens uh so don't worry next episode we will have our gypsy cob one way or the other, we're going to have that Gypsy Cob, or I'm just going to go freaking buy a new one at this point, because it's taken so long. But either way, we will have our new Gypsy Cob by the next episode. I think we're also going to be talking to some groups. Unfortunately, Tommy, as well as the Misfits and the Hateful, I couldn't find any of them around yesterday. It was just a very slow day, so we weren't able to have any talks about the ammo with them. But uh, I do think that's going to be about it for this episode. In the next one, well, of course, we're going to get more into the ammo game, get our Gypsy Cob. Finally, it's been a little bit long enough, but we will get in the next one. And uh, I guess continue on with our adventure. Either way, I hope you guys did enjoy if you did as always make sure to leave a like and if you want to subscribe and i will see you in the next video